Priscilla Presley attends granddaughter's graduation. Riley Keough is noticeably absent. Priscilla Presley was seen attending the graduation of her twin granddaughters, Harper and Finley, but their big sister, Riley Keough, was noticeably absent from their big day. The former wife of Elvis Presley walked separately from the girls and their father, Michael Lockwood, on Saturday after leaving the middle school commencement. In photos, the 14-year-old twin smiled as they chatted with their dad, who was recently granted full custody of them following their mom Lisa Marie Presley's January death. Keo, however, was not present for her younger sister's graduation. Page 6 has reached out to Keo's rep, but did not immediately hear back. The ceremony came days after Priscilla, 77, and the Lodge actress, 33, reportedly settled the dispute over Lisa Marie's trust with the naked gun from the files of police squad actress being granted millions from her late daughter's estate. Details of the settlement were not revealed in court, and both parties will reportedly file a motion to seal the agreement per TMZ. Following the hearing, Priscilla told Page Six in a written statement, My family has resolved all confusion as it relates to our plea to the court and request for document interpretation after my daughter Lisa Marie's untimely passing. Although the media identified such a plea as a lawsuit, I want to make clear that there was never any lawsuit filed against my beloved granddaughter. As a family, we are pleased that we resolved this together. My family and I hope that everyone will grant us the privacy we have needed to properly grieve Lisa Marie and spend personal time together. We love and appreciate all of you. And the Presley family is stronger than ever. Keo's reps did not respond to page 6 requests for comment about the settlement. However, her lawyer Justin Gold told CNN that his client was very content. After Lisa Marie passed away at age 54 after going into cardiac arrest, reports surfaced that there were tensions brewing within the family over her estate. Keo and her brother, Benjamin, were listed as the beneficiaries of their mom's trust. However, when he died by suicide in July 2020, the actress became the sole living heir of Lisa Marie. After the Lights Out singer's death, Priscilla contested her late daughter's will, alleging that a purported 2016 amendment which expelled her and business manager Barry Siegel as trustees was not lawful. A friend of Lisa Marie previously told Page Six that Priscilla's efforts were a money grab. However, the co-founder of Elvis Presley Enterprises claimed to us that she was only trying to keep their family together. From the first moment I held Lisa in my arms, I've protected, loved and guided her, as I have my son she said in February. Our hearts are broken, and I am having to learn to live without my only daughter. Meanwhile, a source later told Page Six that Priscilla and her eldest granddaughter were not on speaking terms. Riley and Priscilla are not talking the insider exclaimed. Their relationship is changing, that is true. It's just so sad. This is the time Riley would really need her grandmother. Priscilla Presley attends her twin granddaughter's middle school graduation but keeps away from their father Michael Lockwood, and Riley Keough does not attend a mid-trust drama over Lisa Marie Presley's estate. Priscilla Presley was the picture of a proud grandmother as she attended her twin granddaughter's middle school graduation, but there was a notable absence from the celebrations. The 77-year-old widow of Elvis was seen at the ceremony of Harper and Finley Lockwood in Los Angeles on Friday along with the girl's father, Michael Lockwood. However, granddaughter Riley Keough stayed away from the celebration. The 33-year-old daughter of the late Lisa Marie Presley has been embroiled in a bitter family feud with Priscilla over her mother's multi-million dollar estate. Lawyers for Elvis's widow and Riley announced Tuesday at a Los Angeles probate court that the two had reached a settlement, but the family drama appears to be far from over. Priscilla proudly watched Friday's graduation ceremony but remained separate from the rest of her family and left on her own. Priscilla wore a glamorous white jacket over a white top and black trousers. Michael looked dapper in a gray suit and matching hat. The family has been dealing with the death of Lisa Marie, who died suddenly at the age of 54 in January, after going into cardiac arrest at her Calabasas home. Riley hopes for no more bad blood with her grandmother Priscilla. After their rancorous legal battle came to a close, it is claimed. Riley is relieved to have settled the dispute over her mom's estate. She doesn't want any drama with her grandmother and insider informed people. When the legal tussle broke out between Riley and Priscilla, the former was hoping they could reach a settlement quickly the source added. At Lisa Marie's memorial service, Riley and her husband Ben Smith-Peterson 
went public with the arrival of their new baby daughter. The source shared that the outbreak of tension between grandmother and granddaughter has been very tough for Riley. She wants to focus on making memories with her own daughter now the insider revealed. This is her priority. Priscilla is happy her attorney Ronson Shaman told DailyMail.com when the settlement was reached. The families are happy and unified and together and excited for the future. Asked if Riley too was happy with the settlement. Her attorney Justin Gold told DailyMail.com. She would not have agreed to the settlement if she was not happy with it. Only two weeks after Lisa Marie's death in January, her mother Priscilla filed a legal challenge to her daughter's will, which gives control of Lisa Marie's wealthy promenade trust to her daughter Riley. Riley, who was reportedly furious when her grandmother went to court to protest the will did not file an objection to Priscilla's challenge. Riley always supported her mother during her drawn-out, often nasty divorce and child custody disputes with her fourth husband, musician Michael Lockwood, 61, father of Lisa Marie's twin, 14-year-old daughters Finley and Harper. It's been reported that Priscilla and Lisa Marie were barely speaking just before the latter's death after Priscilla sided with Lockwood over custody of the twins. Multiple sources told people that the mother and daughter were not on speaking terms, despite appearing at multiple events together, including the premiere for the Elvis biopic starring Austin Butler. Riley was always on her mom's side when it came to Michael, Lockwood one source told the magazine. It bothered her that her grandmother and Michael flew to Lisa Marie's funeral together.